Hi, and welcome to Flip of the Week. Today's subject is the sounds of cymbals. Mm. Cymbals are probably the only instrument that electronics haven't been able to mimic to a point where they're really convincing. But that said, there's a lot of reasons why. I think it's because cymbals just have so many irregularities and characteristics that make them individual. So I'm going to show you a few different ways you can get some different sounds out of a cymbal just by the way you hit it. The first way is, of course, the standard playing the bow of the cymbal, that means the rounded section of it, the larger section, with the tip of the stick. The next way is you can strike along the bow or the edge with the shaft of the stick. That's this wider part of the stick. Next, you can play the bell of the cymbal, either using the tip or the shaft of the stick. Another way that takes a little bit of balance, and you have to make sure that the cymbal isn't in motion, it's a lot easier to do this when the cymbal's still, is playing the edge of the cymbal. It gives a very high frequency pitch sound, almost like that of a harmonic on a guitar. Um, this isn't very loud, but it usually works very well for delicate parts of songs, maybe the ending of a song, something like that. This is the edge of the cymbal. Another way that you can get a different sound out of a cymbal is by using a mallet. So you can build up the wash of a cymbal without really having the attack of sticks. Another sound that you can get is the choked cymbal sound. I'm going to show you a choked cymbal sound on a couple different cymbals. Um, usually this is used for a very small, short, punchy sound, and the trick to it is striking the cymbal and then immediately killing the decay. There's a couple ways you can do this as well. You can either catch it with your hands, or if you can reach to the wider part of the cymbal, if you're using a big cymbal, you can stretch your arm across it. That really kills all the sound of it, and it's kind of theatrical. So this is choking a cymbal. The last sound of a cymbal is similar to the choked sound, only we play the cymbal and all its parts in a choked fashion, which means that I'm going to hold it with my hand and then play all the zones of it. So it's a much shorter staccato sound, and you also hear elements of the high frequency sound you hear when you play the edge of the cymbal. Hope that you like all those ideas. Send in any questions, comments, or any other ideas you have about symbol sounds and different experiments. And we'll see you next time on Flip of the Week.